in one of my courses, I happened to do philosophy. And actually, that's what I'm undertaking this time. And in philosophy, there's a book I'm doing, and I'm trying to summarize that, that book. But what has captiv captivated my mind is the way human beings uh, love fiction. And in fiction, they, I mean, you know, those movies, they can analyze. That's, that's our mind. We can analyze how it will be and even the end of it. And we tend to be good, even in our, in our TV sets, in, if it's a book that we are reading. And I was trying to look at it even and relating it in our lives. And I realized that human beings, when we go through series of difficulties in our lives, we tend, our mind tend to concentrate on the negative side and we analyze it until we see the end of the negativity. And our mind will send us to see how it will be so difficult how the outcome would look like and the outcome would be very difficult and the end of outcome will be a tragedy and our mind would walk through that direction and, and our look, as we're looking at someone maybe in a very difficult marriage instead of working towards it our mind will tell us that this is unworkable this is the end of it and so we stand, start walking like it's end of it. Any kind of a situation or crisis that you are in, our mind will show us the other side. And it's easy, our mind would always like to look at the other side. It's a lot of work to change. But I realized in every difficult situation, as I was reading that book, you can change your mind and you can decide to see the other side of the positivity. But it's not an easy thing. I know it's not an easy thing. Because our mind always loves to be fed with negative things. You know? And that's why in most cases, psychologists would tell us, in most cases when we are in a difficult situation, you tend either to do very weird behaviors. For example, you feel good when you go maybe abusing alcohol, maybe when you overeat, maybe when you do junk, you, very, you feel very comfortable. Vis-a-vis -vis when you do a positive thing. So it's, it's, I realize it's hard work. And so if you're facing or you are in crisis, the, the thing that I would encourage is we feed, we try. It's hard work. So first we have to know that it is hard work. So you need effort to feed your mind with positivity. And I'm telling you, if you feed your mind with positivity, you will get the end results of positivity. So the example that I have just given, if it's a, you're in a crisis, a marriage that is not working, for example, you try to give it a positive thing, such that even if it will end or it will work, it will work for the best. And so any kind of challenge that you could be, any kind of crisis that you could be, Try, no, it's hard work, but try to feed positivity in your mind. And I'm telling you, you'll get positive answer. Thank you so much. It's just that for today, that our mind will always want the negative part. But we can look at it and give our mind the positive part. Thank you so much.